let's find the limit as x approaches 0 of x squared times cotangent 4x over tangent of 5x. The trick here is you want to replace cotangent and tangent in terms of sines and cosines. So cotangent is cosine over sine. And then tangent is sine over cosine. The next step, I want to have uh, basically sine over uh, something x. So before we do that, actually, let's rewrite this. So this cosine 5x will go on the top, and the sine 5x will go on the bottom here. So it's x squared, cosine 4x, cosine 5x over sine 4x, sine 5x. And now I'm, I'm just going to rewrite x squared as 1 over 1 over x squared. So it's like the reciprocal of 1 over x squared is equal to x squared. So it's sine 4x over x, sine 5x over x. But I want this to be over 4x and 5x. So if I put a 4 and a 5, I need to multiply it by 20 because 4 times 5 is 20 like this. You know, the 20 and the 4 and the 5 will cancel. So I'm allowed to do this. Now, if I take the limit of the top, this is equal to 1. This is also equal to 1. Sine of 4x over 4x is also equal to 1. Sine of 5x over 5x is also equal to 1. So what I'm left with is just 1 over 20. And that's going to be my limit.